Hello, this is Kara on Romp Raves. Um, it's pretty nice out compared to what it's been. It's a little windy though, and it's almost freezing. So we'll see how it goes, but I'm gonna record outside today. Um, I had a couple things that I wanted to just kind of show you guys. Um, Tara from Period Attire, um, we did a little bit of a trade with one of each of our pads. Um, I had a pad that she wanted. It's not one that I made, but it's from um, a different company. And then I bought one pad from her. One pad was the pad that we traded. And then I won one of her pads that, um, it was one of the um, pads that's like this. It's the scrap pad. And, Oh, this is the first time that I get to see her business card. That's cute. Yeah. So, there we go. And the pad that we traded for, um, this is the one that I got on hers. It's a uh, heavy absorbency. Ooh, it's windy. <laughs> and it has organic bamboo velour. And this is, it's, the name of it is Autumn Summer. I know that she explained it to me and it sounded amazing. I love the colors. It's way more vibrant even than the pictures she sent me. And I asked to try out her wider width. Um, it's definitely wider. Um, and I asked for two snap settings as well. And it's marked with the heavy absorbency. It is 12 inches long. I just love these colors. I'm so excited to have this pad. <laughs> As you can tell, it's really soft. I love the speckling colors. Alright, so I suppose I should keep moving on. Um, this is the note that's on the back of the business card. I just noticed that. Oh, I guess one more thing was um, these. Um, the cloth tampons that I got. Um, she had a video that she recorded where she was kind of reviewing them with Bryn and she didn't end up liking them or she was she was scared to try them and Bryn didn't really like hers so I got them of course I'll wash them there was only one that was even used so we'll see how they work so there are two that are the full they're just all put together all in one and then there are two that you roll up yourself there are a few other things in here. There's a repeat of her business card. Came in a cute little bag. Um, it looks like there is... It smells really good. I think it's like soap or something. Or it could be a stain stick, possibly, I suppose. So yeah, it's just this. <laughs> so yeah, I guess this one's a little bit more personal. It just says, thanks for doing the trade, and she wishes that I will enjoy her pads. I'm not sure if she threw these in because of the post on my Facebook, but there is a couple different teas, actually quite a few. Um, this one is organic mango green tea. I love mango. and. Yeah, organic is something that really, you know, gets me going. I'm all for that. Whoops. That is going to go off. There is organic raspberry leaf tea. This one is caffeine-free. This one is green tea, so that has um, a moderate amount of caffeine in it. This is elderberry and echinacea. This one, it doesn't say the caffeine content. I'm not going to worry about it, though. This one is organic nettle, fennel, and peppermint tea. Um, Chinese breakfast tea and gunpowder green tea. Alright. I'm just kind of putting everything back in the bag as I go through it. Uh, this is the pad that I purchased. It is... shaped pad. As you can see, it's got the little legs down there, it's got the hands, and the, the wings are the arms, and it has the hat. I just thought this was so
so cute, and she had her shop um, kind of closed off because she wanted to finish up her custom stuff. Um, but I, I just contacted her when we were doing this trade, and I told her about how I really, really wanted to try one. And well, I guess I, she didn't know I was getting this pad specifically, but I told her that there were some things in her shop that I was interested in. So I went ahead and picked this out. She put her shop up for me to order that one thing, and then she turned it back off. So yeah, I'm really excited to try this, and I tested out a little bit with making my own pads that are shaped cool. Um, I know Tenderoni also does pads like this, and I know there are a few other shops that have just tried it out, but they aren't full-time shaped pads like Tenderoni is. Um, it's micro fleece backed, definitely, um, and I'm pretty sure it's flannel and Zorb in the core. Um, it does feel like Zorb, but it feels like there's something more than Zorb in there. Um, it's a moderate absorbency, and it kind of sounds funny. It's not P-U-L. It might just be the combination of being outside and the micro fleece, because I'm not used to micro fleece, but I, I like it a lot. She used bright thread to go with the bright back, which I like. And the last thing, which I already showed, was the scrap pad, which I'm super excited to try out because nobody has really done this before. I, I kind of thought about it myself. Um, with using up the, s the scraps that I had left, but I never I never really tried it because I was like, oh, you know, if there are different fabric types, they're going to like stretch different and everything, and I just never tried it out. But it's all cotton on top. They're just sewn together. It's three different fabrics, although these might be just the same, the same print in different colors. I'm not sure. But I really like it, and I love the back that she picked, the back color. She used her ribbon. Uh, yeah, I'm super excited about this. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll just keep moving along. She messaged me today and she um, told me that she sent a couple things along for my sister. Um, so there's another business card and it has a little note for her, it says that there are two light flow pads and the witch has P-U-L in it. Maybe that's why mine sounded funny. Maybe mine has P-U-L in it too. I'm not sure. I didn't think it was, but possibly. And it just says to for her to enjoy the pads. So, came with a little ribbon on it. Very cute. The first one is just her regular design. So, it's topped in this really, really cute it has foxes on it. I love foxes. Um, foxes are kind of a thing in our family. I wish she was here for the unboxing. I wish I could have showed these to her on camera. But I'm about to go to work and the younger kids haven't gotten out of school yet. So I guess that won't happen. But she will definitely have a chance to review these when she's tried them. And maybe I'll do like a first impressions thing when I give them to her. I'm not sure. We'll see. The ribbon is pink for light flow. Um, I'm not sure the length. Um, it looks like it's about somewhere around 8 inches long. I'm not sure for sure. And then there is also another witch pad. Okay, now that I feel this, mine definitely doesn't have PUL. Uh, but it's PUL and then there's micro fleece pink. And this is another print that I was looking at her in her shop that I almost picked out a pad with. It's very cute. It's springy. It's nice to think about spring when it's almost winter. <laughs> winter is not fun. It's Fall is my favorite season. I love the colors and everything. So I'm pretty sure it's the same as mine. Yeah, it's the same length and everything. Actually, it's, it's slightly longer. It's probably just with stitching differences, though. If I match up the feet, the head is that much taller, but it's not even a centimeter, so it doesn't matter. Um, I got mine for Halloween in the baddie print and I'm not sure what this print is called but it's very cute. Um, this one she did kind of a flowery stitching down there which definitely matches the spring look. I think I'm gonna stop there. <laughs> stop ravishing over everything. But anyway yeah I just wanted to show you guys what I got in the mail because it made me really excited. I opened up the mailbox and there's just this bulging package kind of popping out at me and I was super excited and she said that she sent them two days ago so I'm gonna send her package out probably tomorrow possibly tonight I'm not sure we'll 
see, but I don't, I don't know if she'll do an unboxing or anything. I know she has lots on her plate right now. So yeah, thank you very much, Tara, and that's all, so see you next video.